With all the high-tech hoopla these days, the lowly ball feeder sends balls down through tubes to a ball pusher. A ball divider positions the balls evenly. Next comes the ball cage, a metal cage that retains the balls in position. The balls harden. This entire process takes a few days. These balls started out as steel wire. A machine cut them into pieces and a die punched them into rough balls. Those balls go into a grinder which removes the bumps. Then other machines round them out and give them a mirror finish. Next stop, washing. They coat these balls with thick oil and a fine stone grit. Then they get a bath in cleaning solvent. After several quality checks, the finished balls go into hoppers. This vibration tester makes sure the ball operates quietly. Some types of balls are lubricated with grease. A machine squirts grease evenly, then inserts a rubber seal to contain the grease. A final quality control test. An automated scale tosses out any bum balls that aren't the required weight. The good ones move on to the laser which marks them with information such as the part number and the trademark.